We have a birthday in the house. How old are you, Jacob? Twelve. Twelve years old. Almost a teenager. The Crazy Picker Life with Wheeler, Dealer, and Banana Peeler. I'm Wheeler, and I'm dreaming of cameras. I don't like it. 7.44. 7.44, just leisurely camping around. Yep. We gotta get some breakfast at the hotel, and we need to get out the door. Yep. Mom just texted me, happy birthday. Oh, here I am focusing on Sleepy Wheeler. We have a birthday in the house. How old are you, Jacob? 12. 12 years old. Almost a teenager. Mm -hmm. yeah. Happy birthday, Jacob. Maybe we'll have some fun today, maybe not. <laughs> okay, this is breakfast. All your four basic food groups including donuts, danish, bagel, fruit, fruit, and dairy I guess, sort of activa, Ooh, getting active. Oh, birthday boy. Wet or greasy? Wet. I know. Greasy <laughs> dude. Greasy dude. Good morning, fellow pickers and would-be adventurers. This is Dealer with the Crazy Picker Life. Looking out of our hotel parking lot. They're creating some sort of a new car dealership here. Lots of activity starting early in the morning, including digging, riveting, trucks, Really not too uh, noisy here. We got uh, I-90 highway winding past through construction. Looks like it's gonna be a beautiful weather day. We've got some things to wrap up uh, today out at the state project. I don't know if we can get out and do some picking today, but we'll have some exciting stuff on the show and we're planning for tomorrow and Friday to do some uh, picking in the area and out of town so stay tuned for that this is the more mature banana peeler he's entered 12 years old Lost all his teeth. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's not supposed to happen until a little later in life. Came up a little bit older there. Okay, enjoy the show. Thanks for watching. Oh, by the way, this is a picking show, sort of. <laughs> okay, a little nostalgia. Here's a uh, dealer's first house. And we sold this, gosh, at least 15 years ago. Maybe closer to 20. My uh, beautiful wife, Lon, and I have six children, and they are all home birthed. So this is also the birthplace of Wheeler, right in those upper rooms there. And Kate, my daughter, who's 15. And she, uh, yeah, we must have sold this 15 years ago. She was born and we moved out not too long after. The midwife was late in a storm, broke her ankle in the driveway. She did make it, however, dealer delivered the baby. Oh yeah, that was a weird, crazy day and baby sure are, <coughs> baby sure are slippery. Okay, and then down here, unbelievable, our old neighbor Jumbo is sitting in his garage, so we need to go visit with him. See if he remembers us. Wednesday morning, can't 
Can't pass up a rummage sale. Well, we're doing a little camping today. We got the fire department over here with his fire shield on to keep things under control. But we're gonna get the marshmallows out. Oh man, Jacob, we're losing some. We're losing some. Valuable. Uh, we're trying to keep this uh, under control. Make sure the neighbors don't call 911. Well, we got uh, my nephew Jordan is on his Segway. Now this is uh, this is an early prototype that we found at an auction of a Segway. It's before they motorized them. It's not quite as uh, elegant. Good work. Hope you can get to where you're going. Oh, it's about midday. Things are going well. Uh, just want to give a tip for being in the heat. Stay hydrated. So you can see on the left there, my water bottle is well drank. So you got to have lots of water. And then if you're drinking beer, like the beer that is Milwaukee's favorite, Blatt's, drink Blatt's light. You'll be just fine. Oh, who the heck is that? Oh, wait, that's my nephew. <laughs> Mayday, 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 propeller has stopped functioning. Dude, throw it. Mayday, Mayday, going over the volcano. Oh, I'm afraid we're not going to make it over the volcano. Say goodbye. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Hot fire. Oh, it's, we're burning. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yep, there goes all the wings and everything. From a picker standpoint, it can't be shipped, and the motor was only half there and seized up. Uh, okay, this is a crazy picker life. This is the spider. Itsy bitsy spider goes up the volcano. Down came the rain and washed away the spider. Well, we just have too much stuff, so the crazy stuff has to go too. I'm sorry. It's not very exciting, but... Lake's starting to start on fire. The good, the bad, and the ugly. So my family has owned several sailboat boats through the last 30, 40 years. This one uh, we picked up free somewhere along the lines and it's a wreck. So I looked up to see what we could do with it. We're definitely not going to burn it. But I think what we're going to do is end up putting uh, a free sign on it and bringing it somewhere and then we'll get rid of it. I don't know why I'm vlogging it. but. If you want it, come and get it. So if you ever have to clean out a real large estate and you happen to have the fortunate ability to be in the country, you can burn a bunch of stuff. We um, sold a bunch of stuff, brought a bunch of stuff to various uh, Goodwills, Salvation Armies, and small thrift stops. We've got a bunch of stuff on Craigslist. My uh, my parents were not hoarders. However, they had a lot of stuff. And my dad was a collector of all kinds of things. And some of it, just you just can't do anything with it. You can't keep it. I'm not the kind of guy that keeps all kinds of stuff. And so... Here's the campfire. This is the bottom of the barrel. Besides trash stuff, this is where it ends up. A little sombering. You can see the old greenhouse over there. We used to have a greenhouse where we grew all kinds of crazy stuff. Had some uh, 
catfish in there to keep the, the heat in there in the winter. There was a sort of a tank and a pond in there. It was really cool. Actually, um, when I was 18 or 19 years old, 18 or 19, no, let me see, how old was I? Well, sometime between 18 and 23, we built that. That was quite a project. It, uh, it was supposed to be an easy project. Of course, marketing always makes things easy. It was not that easy to get that thing geometric. So, kind of a long day. Uh, we got as far along as we needed to get along. I mean, I, I keep sharing little snippets here. I know it doesn't all make sense to everybody that's watching. So we cleared out a house and it was bigger than a house. It was a huge house. And um, big garage, extra garage attached to it. We're gonna work on that a little bit tomorrow night after we go picking all day. And then there's still that. And that's full of car parts and all kinds of crazy stuff. And there's not too much in the chicken house slash wood shop slash not much in there anymore. So, beautiful setting out here. Didn't spend as much time in my younger days out here as I would have liked. My, uh, my parents bought this land and such when I was already grown and, and away and uh, started having kids, hustle and bustle. It's pretty nice. However, uh, you know, things you got to deal with when... Uh, people get older and pass away and go away so everybody has to do it everybody has to deal with it fire is a little hypnotic we still don't have the marshmallows it's kind of a semi-toxic fire though, so I'm not sure that would work out. There's a little bit of everything in there. So this is a pretty nice setup out here. It's my brother-in-law's pad. Nice house, nice shop, all works. But this, the Schlitz. It's five o'clock somewhere, and let's see, 439 here, 430, 439, what are you talking about? Woo! Five o'clock somewhere, 439 here, it might as well be five o'clock. So, it is Jacob's uh, Banana Peeler's birthday here, we're gonna get some supper here soon. After I enjoy my Schlitz and my brother-in-law gets his shower all done or whatever, I'm going to go all stinky, but we're going to go bowling and out to supper and have some fun. You know what's that one? <clears throat> I guess we are in a garden. I'm enjoying my drink. Some kind of an olive garden. Where's, where are the olives? <laughs> I just realized In my that. stomach. I, we ate all. <sighs> I don't want to get arrested. I'm, I'm good. Okay, here's the sad state of America. This used to be not only a club, not only a bowling alley, not only a destination. Black Bridge Bowl, Janesville, Wisconsin. R.I.P. No longer available. On to the next place. After bowling or after uh, Olive Garden, you need a, a pastel ribbon and Lionese Creamy Dark. Uncle Ron, kids, kids, bowling.
Now I bowled at uh, Claymore Bowl 40 years ago. This is now changed to Rivers Edge Bowl. They redid the whole shoot match here. This is nothing like I remember. But as with anything, age, years, changes everything. Everything.